Hey guys, Edward here from Red Dot Photo. So we got some new things from Godox and let's get to it right away. It is actually a projection attachment that is meant for the S30 Lite, but we also brought in a Bowens mount to S to the projection attachment adapter. So you can mount on Godox lights or different brand lights that has a good Bowens mount. So some of the uh, gobo patterns that we have, we have four sets and they all come uh, six global patterns so there's different things like moonlight there's windows there's fire etc etc and there's also some other accessories that we brought in uh, inclusive of the global set holder and also a framing shutter that you can take and insert into the attachment projection attachment like so so this helps to cut the light very nicely and very sharp so let's get to the assembly of it and we'll show you all the different patterns at the end of the video. Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so right now we're going to show you how to attach everything together, together with a bow mount light. Well, one, this, one thing that we noticed first was actually this part here. Might seem very deep, but we were trying it with the Godox SL100D and the bow mount actually cannot fit in. So just be careful of what light you're using and how deep is the front point here. Most of them are quite flat, like this 60W, so that should be fine. So bow mount straight forward, straight forward easy, bow mount, just turn in. The projection attachment is slightly more uh, uh, difficult, but not too difficult as well. There's actually grooves here. So the grooves, you only can get closer like even. So the grooves actually fit onto these portions here. Okay, so I'm gonna show it. So it kind of slides in. It slides in, there's, there's, there's nothing to it. And the top attachment here is a drop and hook kind of attachment. So it should be sturdy, you can give it a little bit of a jiggle and make sure that it's, it's really sturdy. Okay, one thing to note is the gobo uh, portion here. So the gobo portion, the part, the point where you fit in all the gobos is actually this groove here. So what I would recommend is to face this groove onto the top so that it's easy for you to slide your gobo in. So just demonstration on how to adjust the lens in front. Uh, you actually loosen one of the knobs here. Then you shift the lens back and forth and you achieve your sharpness. Uh, kind of eyeball it sometimes. Lah. Okay, then talking about the frame shutters. Take this portion and slide it in. So there's a groove here. The camera should be able to see that. There's a groove here. So slide the framing shutter in and that cuts the light. Likewise, for the gobo, take the gobo, face it forward. Okay, not backwards. Face it forward and slide it. Okay, so this one better to be two-handed, two-handed operation. Uh, you push with one hand, push up the flap so that your gobo holder can go in. So that's actually about it. So we have shown you how to mount the bone mount adapter, the projection attachment. We have shown you how to adjust your focus, shown you how to put in the framing shutter as well as the gobo holder with gobos. I hope this video has helped you. If you guys got any questions, just drop it in the comments below and let us know. And have a good day, have a good life. Thanks guys.